Android users, I always share a lot of custom rooms with you. And in this video, we have one more custom room. This is Axiom AOSP. And this is one of the only few custom rooms which is actually having some amazing options. And I'll show you all of them in this video. So make sure to watch this video till the end. Video is going to be quite interesting. Some features, some things which are actually amazing in this one. We'll find out all of them in this one. This is based on the latest Android version, which is Android 15, of course. And having a look at some of the things, the default wallpaper, always actually the one of the thing which is quite under it that is default wallpaper that also matters a lot and yes default wallpaper looks good the app opening app closing speed is good and as expected it's not having the pixel launcher pre-installed which is good i mean if you need customizations if you need features we have this xcn launcher settings but let me show you one thing if you click on this ui switcher you will find rising ui so yes that's also one of the only few custom rooms which is bringing you almost every thing which is available in rising OS, but it's not exactly like that we have some differences let me show you as you can see it is now giving me some force issues but that's not the case let me show you simply just simply clear this from the recents now let me show you by opening this once again now it's working perfectly fine so it's not a bug it's just simple thing if you just switched a new ui switched to a new ui simply force or you can simply remove this thing from the recent panel once and simply start back and this is working perfectly fine this is the ui and you have all the same features in the launcher settings which you have in rising OS. the back gesture seems to be different one which is actually a themed one you can say the back icon you can say that's a different thing so that's one of the things which is available in xcn os it was not a part of any other custom room as far as i know as you can see the logo this logo is also seems to be it seems to be rising os logo so that's quite strange to see many custom rooms are giving almost same features from rising os nothing new that's not good personally speaking taking a look at the quick settings panel it's having similar options but the ui is a bit inspired from fluid os if you have heard about that custom room the ui was actually uh, almost similar in that custom room i also used that custom for a long time so that is the thing everything else is just similar looking forward to circle to search because that's also one of the features which many people consider about it's available it's working fine with this default launcher which is Excel launcher you can say the launcher based on launcher 3 having all the same options all the same customizations for you you just need to update your google app once and things should work for you as you can see it's working fine circle to search is working almost everywhere including this one let me show you one more thing which is actually something different which is the volume panel as you can see it's a themed version of the volume panel personally speaking it's actually different because it's not available in any other custom room as far as i know while making this video the custom rooms i have tried on my device the volume panel is not available there at least not available by default in this case it's the default one the settings ui is almost similar to qpr updates which is available in the google pixel devices or you can say in many custom rooms only few minor tweaks here and there nothing much about these things and of course taking a look at the customizations it's not a customization focused room but still brings you a few of the things which we will talk about in this one let me show you one more thing in security and privacy options you will find that we have the option for scramble layout which actually matters a lot including this one because it's based on android 15 so the private space feature is here it is working fine i'm not exactly sure how many of you use the private space feature but personally speaking the feature seems to be quite exciting one it's a different one as compared to work profile almost similar of course but with better optimizations or you can see with the better things are you can improved thing in the terms of multi-user things of course i use this thing a lot on my device in my case it's not working sometimes but sometimes it works so minor bugs i found things are working but sometimes it just freezes so maybe my device issue but it is what it is lock screen clock this is not the custom one this is a default clock it's does it does not bring you the customized lock screen option although and if you take a look at this lock the this lock screen clock this is a default one it's not a themed one it's already a default one so many things are themed by default these are considered as a special features according to them so having all the same options in a different section that is what it is we have edge lighting options uh, which is i mean if you use this thing it's good if you don't then simply skip this thing multi window option 
which considers uh, which consists of sidebar if you use sidebar then it is what it is this is the aosp floating window by default and if you want to switch into lmo free form let me show you by moving into this simply choose lmo free form then choose anything else and then you'll be able to resize it and place it anywhere this is the difference what we have in this floating windows or you can say sidebar in simple words game space is also here if you use this feature this is here gesture same options we have the three finger swipe gestures or you can say custom three finger swipe gestures and including that we have other gestures available too hiding the navigation bar space at least it is here it is working fine so that's good i personally use the third option visualizer is same for the music lovers you might love this thing if you are not a music lover then simply skip this thing on your device for sure so yes these are things just wanted to let you know for now it's available only for the few of the devices or especially for the pixel devices and if you hold any pixel device you can try it out on your device so this is it thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one until then take care and make sure to like the video we'll see you in the next one